This magnificent mosaic has been discovered in a muddy farmer's field in Rutland in the East Midlands. It was found by the farmer's son while out walking during the lockdown. The mosaic depicts a scene from Homer's epic poem, the Iliad, and although a handful like it have been unearthed in other parts of Europe, it's the first of its kind ever discovered in the UK. The site has now been granted protection following a recommendation from Historic England. Our Midlands correspondent Phil Mackey has been to meet the man who stumbled across a piece of history. Hidden for more than a millennium and a half, a mosaic so rare nothing like it's ever been found in the UK before and it's part of a much bigger Roman villa complex from the 3rd or 4th centuries. Excavations were carried out this summer in a farmer's field in Rutland, but the discovery was made in 2020 by the farmer's son, Jim Irvine. It was amazing, really. I mean, the level of preservation. He found some pottery fragments, then checked satellite imagery and noticed the outline of what looked like ancient buildings. And this is the, the mosaics in this section. All of this so the family came back on a sunny day with some spades and started digging. You know, you can only tell so much from a map and from some crop marks and, until you actually dig a hole, you don't really know what's in it. So that was uh, a good day out. We didn't really know that what we had. So the, uh, the, I expanded the hole up a bit until we came across some uh, what was obviously uh, Roman mosaic tiles, at which point things went a bit uh, silent you know, in the group and um, we uh, realised what we had. Uh, what Late it? Roman pottery. Gives us a date of 3rd, 4th century AD. So it tells The University of Leicester provided the archaeologists who've removed some artefacts for study. It's the, uh, the most com uh, complicated and uh, complete plan of a Roman villa we found. But the, the icing on the cake really is this fantastic mosaic. It's so unique and it really emphasises how important this place was. Well, the mosaic's been covered up again. It's back beneath the soil. That's for its own protection. But it's hoped, at least it's hoped by Jim, that at some point in the future it can be uncovered again so that people can come and see it for themselves. I would really like people to be able to do that. In fact, I'm going to order my toga and sandals when I get back so I can show people around. The best way to preserve this archaeology is to preserve it in situ, um, which is where it is now, and it can be opened up occasionally for people to look at in future generations. They've only excavated a tiny part of the site so far, so there could be many more discoveries in the digging seasons to come. Phil Mackey, BBC News, Rutland. Absolutely stunning.